Hey 3DMJers, Coach Brad here. It's been a while since I've been on the YouTube videos and so I thought, you know what, nice easy way to, to break back into making videos again is to make a nice easy My Favorite Things video. Uh, kind of going over one of my favorite things, my gym bag. And then also kind of in the same breath kind of give thanks to some folks that treat us really, really good um, and, and are very, very generous to Team 3DMJ. Uh, the other day I was in the, the gym and, and somebody came up to me and approached me and said, gosh, you know, that is an amazing collection of stuff that you've got in your gym bag. Where'd you get all of that? You know, and I started thinking about it and I'm like, you know what? I don't think, with the exception of, of my, my Nike Romellos here, okay, I have not paid for one single thing in my gym bag. And it's all been given to me through the generosity of some very generous folks. And, um, and yeah, I just was like, that's an amazing thing. How lucky uh, could a guy be, you know, to have all this stuff that basically I use all the time, almost every single day, and um, not have paid a cent for it. So really pretty grateful for that. So as you can see, my gym bag here is basically a... An old football bag that I inherited from my son, and it's pretty big. It's a big bag. I can fit a lot of stuff in there, which is a good thing because uh, I usually never train at the same place twice. Um, so uh, without further ado, let me go ahead and start with my uh, beloved 3DMJ Chuck Taylors. These were from my wife. It was a Christmas gift. She got them custom made, and uh, one of my favorite pair of shoes to wear. All right, next is my uh, my my roller. I'm a big fan of rolling, and this was a custom made um, roller uh, with our logo on it and uh, this nice little insignia here on the back by uh, Barbell One. Um, they were also nice enough to make all of us coaches these watches that um, are pretty cool as well. You know, kind of showing off the fact that we're we are weightlifters. Um, so yeah, Barbell One, very nice enough to, to give all of us coaches uh, some very, very neat stuff. And again, something I use all of the time. Um, next, I guess that would be my, my weight belt. This was custom made for me, as you can tell. Pretty hard for this to get bar far from me. Um, by one of my favorite clients, basically of all time. And uh, he gave me permission to say his name. He's from Australia. His name is Ryan Anthony. And um, Ryan has been very good to me over the years. Sent me, on more than one occasion, uh, some really neat gifts. And uh, Ryan, uh, ironically, started his own group, uh, NPS, Natural Physique Sciences in Australia. They're kind of the 3D muscle journey of Australia. And uh, ironically, you know... I guess coach has become student because now Ryan is doing my programming and uh, really enjoying the, the programming that he's doing for me. So again, something I use all the time, you know, very, very lucky to have such a, a cool device. All right, next up would be my knee sleeves. These were uh, a, a nice little gift from my in-laws. Family support is always, always big you know, in the sport of bodybuilding, especially when sometimes we tend to get a little bit on the hyper-focused side and let the family kind of go by the wayside. Try not to, but sometimes it's just kind of an inevitable thing that happens. Uh, I guess next would be my shaker bottle. Use this all the time. And I always keep a bottle of amino acids in my gym bag here. AST has been really, really good to me uh, over the years. Um, we started working together through sponsorship and, and, and exposure in 2009. Gosh, it's hard to believe, six years now. And, um, you know, just, I was always a big fanboy uh, of AST, you know, even since the late 90s. And um, I worked really hard to, to convince them that, you know what, I can, I can be of value uh, to AST, and I really feel like, you know, I can help you guys out. And ever since then, they've just treated me so good, and I really have to give thanks for all of the stuff that they give me. All right, closing down on the end of it, here's, uh, this is something that I don't use all the time, but we got some Inzer knee sleeves, and 
these were given to us um, through some promoters with the USPA. My wife's very first powerlifting meet. She compa she powerlifted before I did, and uh, I coached her to her first meet. And we showed up, and they're like, "You don't have any knee wraps," and uh, we're like, "Yeah, don't know what they are." You know, I was brand new to powerlifting. They gave us these, and uh, Jim and Grass Valley. I can't remember the name of it right now, but two brand new pair of inter knee knee, uh, um, knee wraps they gave us. And again, I still use them to this day. Um, all right, next would be, this is one of my favorite devices. This is a brute belt. I did a review on this on our channel probably about, oh, I guess it's been about a year now. But uh, all time best dip belt. And uh, if you want to see that review, I'll, I'll, I'll throw up the link to that video in the description box. But uh, yeah, the, the folks at Brute Belt were kind enough to give us coaches all uh, a Brute Belt. And something I use all the time, you know what, to be honest with you, sometimes I will loan this to people in the gym that are doing, you know, weird things. Like I was the other day, I was watching a couple gals being trained by a client and they had a dip belt on and they're dragging like, you know, 90 pounds of chains around the gym. And they only had one dip belt, and it was one of those old-fashioned kinds. So there was two of them. I'm like, you want to use this because this is a whole lot more comfortable, and that way you guys wouldn't have to switch back and forth. And, um, yeah, they were amazed with how comfortable this thing is. Um, All righty, almost done here. Got a couple of cool wristbands here. These were given to me. I use these occasionally, but to be honest with you, they keep my... Uh, my wrist wraps from being unraveled and uh, falling apart in my gym. But these were given to me uh, through the promoters and owners of the WNBF. They were in our little gift bags uh, when I did the WNBF Pro USA last year. So just one more thing in my gym bag that was given to me. And um, yeah, looks like that's about it. There's the extent of my my favorite things. You know, I think it's kind of funny that I think sometimes the things that are the most valuable to us are the things that we use, like, all of the time. And uh, at least that's the way I feel. And uh, I feel very, very grateful to have this stuff that I use all the time. I use four or five times a week. And, you know, like I said, with the exception of my Nike Ramellas, I didn't pay for any of it. It was all given to me. And for that, I feel very lucky. And uh, I want to thank all of those great folks for, for treating us so good. And hopefully this is just a small token uh, of my appreciation to them. And, um, yeah, I just want to express that. So I'll leave it there until next time in the next video. Uh, thanks for all your support. Thanks for all of your encouragement of 3D Muscle Journey. And uh, keep training hard. Keep training naturally. Thank you very much.